Hello, Brian Lynch here. It's April 2nd, 2013. I'm out at my house doing some last minute dormant spraying on a uh, plum tree behind me that in three years has gotten a lot taller than I am. And in order to spray all the branches, what I'm using is my uh, long reach sprayer, uh, which can get up to the very highest branches uh, quite easily without me having to get on a ladder. And it's pretty easy to make one of these sprayers yourself. Uh, what I did, uh, I just got a uh, I think this was a $6 sprayer at my local home improvement store. I then chopped uh, the wand part of the sprayer in half. I stuck a quarter inch brass barb into one end of uh, the wand, uh, attached quarter inch uh, tubing. Not exactly sure what kind of tubing it is, but uh, just quarter inch tubing, thin diameter tubing. Stuck everything onto a, uh, I believe this is a half inch aluminum pipe or tube, but it's something light from a home improvement store, and secured everything on this tube to the very end where I stuck the other half of the wand uh, that I chopped off, and uh, I secured everything with uh, wire ties. It was very uh, easy to make and inexpensive, I think I spent less than $10, probably the most expensive part, aside from the sprayer, was the brass fitting which cost me, I think, $2 compared to the, uh, the sprayer, which was 6 I, I used as small of diameter of tubing as possible so that the sprayer reacted quite quickly when I pressed the button. Uh, it'll start spraying and stop spraying uh, within about a fraction of a second of when I actually press the lever.